previously on Minecraft. But that would be a problem. Quit staring at me! Jeez, you're you're just so rude. Man, how would you like it? How would you like if I just stared at you? You don't like it. You're a little self-conscious about it, aren't you? A little self-conscious. See, you walk away. Just walk away. Oh, look how quick that grass grew. Holy cow. Oh. <laughs> There's a hole there. Watch your step. Oh my gosh. It, it's growing very, very fast, which is great. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of some Minecraft on the Xbox 360 edition. I am the Element of Steve, and today, or when we last left off, we were doing this. We were doing where we're at. We're here, we put down these wonderful fence posts, and that's what we did. So today, today's Friday for you guys, right? Right? I think so, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, today. Today's a happy day for me. I am, I, right now, I am on a plane or at, or at Atlanta airport waiting for another plane. Or maybe I've already left Atlanta, depending on when you watch, and I'm on my way to Orlando for Minecon, and I'm super duper excited. Yes, super excited to ride on a plane to head to Minecon to hang out with my friends and to meet some new friends. Yes, really, really am. And uh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's really awesome. It's really great. And, um, you know, I, I really look forward to it. I mean, our, because, uh, you know, uh, tomorrow I'm going to act acting like as I've already been there. I've already done it because, well, why not? Uh, <laughs> a year from now, who's going to know better? Uh, <laughs> but yeah, I, I really am excited about about what's going to happen here, happen at Minecon. I'm excited about getting to to really get to meet the red cubers that are all going, which there's a lot of them. And I'm excited about, what is up there? Oh shoot! What are you doing in the trees? Oh, you, I wasn't in a tree. Okay, I'm good. He didn't blow up barely. Oh, he blew up the whole top of this tree. Oh well. There we go. I'm trying to find a way up there that's gonna be easy to get up there. Cause I wanna go to, well, I need to get back to the main island anyway so we'll just go this way mm -do. yeah I should have probably built something on those I don't know I don't think I'm gonna build any more platforms it depends we'll see what happens who knows what might, might, might come up maybe I'll decide to do a go over here Ugh. there we go I'll decide to do like a, a, sh a breeding area for for doggies and kitties who knows probably not we'll see what happens I got a lot of episodes left like like a few <laughs> let's see so this is gonna be like so November let's see well, let's, let's think through this so today is the first right oh man I didn't say happy Halloween yesterday happy Halloween yesterday totally wait 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 hang on today's Friday I'm on this episode Wednesday th yeah sorry I totally did not say happy Halloween yesterday I apologize oh I also didn't tell you this I asked a question, uh, I gave you guys a description of, a, of an item, and I asked you guys to, to guess what it was, um, two episodes ago, three episodes ago, anyway, and, uh, by the way, if you guys didn't know, if you haven't been paying attention, this is my third recording in a row, because I'm getting ready for Minecon, anyway, uh, why did I come all the way over here, I didn't have to come all the way over here to do what I'm about to, about to do, Ay poo, um, but, the, the item that it was, was a bottle, a glass bottle, a root beer bottle, to be more precise. Um, yeah, so that's what the item was. I don't know if anybody, get, as of this recording, nobody guessed that. But that is what it was. So, uh, yeah, really, really good root beer. Well, I say it was good root beer. What kind of root beer was it? Oh, geez. It's some, it's actually some health nut root beer is what it was. Uh, all natural that type of thing and uh it's pretty good i mean it was decent actually what's funny is the first time i tried it the first time i had it like um it, it was it was a zero it's called zero so like it's root beer zero and it's uh got zero it's every it's all natural essentially and the first time i had it i was like yuck that's gross but then i drank like a couple more and then i'm like yay i'm drinking root beer out of a bottle and it's delicious so but we're all out now. All the root beer's gone. So, anyway. But that's what I was guessing. No, that's what I was describing. I said something brown, slender, but long. And it holds stuff. I didn't want to sit there and say, like, you know, holds liquids or it's glass. Because that kind of gives it away, right? So, anyway. I'll have to check the comments 
uh, later on to see if anybody actually ever guesses it. Uh, or if they guessed it between the time that I recorded this and the time that I actually put, that I had this video go up. That'd be interesting to know. So, anyway. What do I got to say? Oh yeah, my god. Yes, I'm on my way. So here's what, here's my itinerary for today. My itinerary for today, Friday, as I know of it on Tuesday, <laughs> because that's the day I'm recording, is that I'm going to wake up. I'm going to take my book bag, because that's all I'm taking with me is a book bag, or backpack, and I'm gonna, that's because I wanna make it so I don't have to have any, I'm gonna make it, a, you know, just carry on, so I don't have to worry about losing luggage, right? And I'm going to head over to, uh, trying to think of the quickest way there. I've done this like 10 times. I should just know the quickest way there. And that's not, that's a pretty quick way down, but that's not the quickest way there. Uh, but I'm gonna head on over to the airport. I gotta be there by, uh, my plane leaves at a little after 10, I think, or 10.30. You're dead, you're dead, you're dead. You're dead, go away, all right. Um, so I gotta get to the airport probably, I'll get there by nine. Um, uh, probably have my dad drop me off because Elemental will, see, will be at work at that point. Um, uh, my dad does not work during the day, so he can definitely do it. Uh, he works at night. He does do some work during the day, but mostly nights. So, um, so I'll have my dad drop me off. I'm glad these vines grew because I would be in trouble if they didn't. This is not growing as fast as the other ones were, but I guess that's understandable. All right, and then uh, what else are we gonna do? So I'll hop on the plane, so I'll be in Atlanta. I'm flying to Atlanta first. And uh, from Greensboro, from PTI to Atlanta. And then I'm flying from Atlanta to Orlando, but I have like an hour and a half layover in Atlanta. Which is not that bad, so that's kind of good. I mean, it gets you time to to get around. Atlanta's airport is it's pretty sizable, but it kind of reminds me of of my airport here, in my local airport. Um, pretty plain. Uh, I've been a few. Like I went to uh, many years ago when I was in high school. I went to uh, Mexico, and um, we flew. No, I went to I went to Mexico and Colorado. So I actually threw I flew through twice in high school. That's actually the last time I was on a plane too, I think. I'm pretty sure. Uh, both those trips. So the one on the, to Colorado, I've been to a bunch of airports and uh, on those trips. Actually, I always end up in Atlanta. So I guess I haven't been to a bunch, but I went to the Denver airport. Denver airport is like the best airport. It's like a giant tent. It's amazing. Uh, I don't know why I like it so much. I just do. And if you've ever been there, you know what I'm talking about. But the Atlanta airport is just pretty plain. Uh, it's more... I guess corporate, I guess, just kind of plain Jane, corporate-y type airport. Like, you know, corporate businessmen will be flying in and out of there type thing, I guess. I don't know, at least that's how I remember it. It's been like 12 years since I've been there. But uh, anyway, maybe I'll be, I have a big surprise when I get there, I doubt it. But I'll be there for like an hour and a half. Hopefully I'll meet up with somebody there. I actually, we have a Minecon group on, um, uh, on Skype and uh, I posted my schedule, my flight schedule, to say, you know, asking if anybody was going to be joining me on any of those flights, and it turns out no, nobody's joining anybody. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Uh, you would think that even though we're all flying from different parts of the country, you would think that we would meet up. Some of us would meet up, but that's not how it happened. As it has happened at this point, uh, not everybody's posted their schedules, but at this point, it's not happening. Um, because there's all like central hubs for most airports, right? You know, most airports. You know, fly like my airport. My airport always flies to Atlanta. That's just where it flies to, right? Uh, and then from Atlanta, it goes everywhere else. So, you know, it's kind of like JFK is one of those central. From my right, my understanding is like one of those central hubs where everybody flies from from there. Hang on, Elemento is texting me from the other room. Let's see what she has to say. Uh, C. Yes, please. She asked if I want her, if she wants me to wants me if she wants me. Wait, if she wants. If if I want her, that's the words I was looking for, to bring her bring me some fruit so I can eat it. And I'd be very excited about that. Where is my last one? Where is it? Is that it right there? Oh there it's over there. Okay. I hear you, zombie. 
Let's see. Uh, so, okay, so after uh, Atlanta, right? Um, flying into Orlando, and I'll be in, in Orlando by 2.30, which is great. Except for the fact that everybody else is getting in at 6 and 6.30. Like, Drew's getting in at 6.05. Um, Poet's getting in, I think that's right, in 6.30. Uh, uh, well, yeah, so everybody's... This grew fast, too. Hmm. Um, and, you know, I'm like, dang, I'm going to be all by myself. And but the good the good thing is that I got Drew to see Drew actually bought my ticket um, because I was actually out of town when my con when uh, tickets went on sale and there was no possible way I was gonna be able to buy a ticket right because I was in a place that had very bad internet and I would only be able to get on my phone and it's had very bad internet and um, no possible way I could have gotten a ticket but luckily Drew got me one so Drew sent me out my my ticket because uh, with the registration uh, you, you had to register on Friday and Saturday morning right. You register to, to, you know, for Minecon. I guess during registration, you probably get your swag bag that gets you all your stuff. You know, your all your, you know, your cape, <laughs> your Minecraft, your Minecon cape and stuff like that. Uh, at least that's what they've done the last two years. I assume they're going to do it again. Um, but yeah, uh, and and so I'm going to register, and I, I'm like, okay, well, I might as well while I'm waiting four hours for everybody to show up, or three and a half hours for everybody to show up. I might as well go ahead and do something. So I figured I'd go register uh, and then, uh, you know, register for Minecon. And then uh, after that, I'll just sit there and wait for Poet and Drew to show up. I just burped, sorry. For uh, Poet and Drew to show up and win winter. Um, and yeah, from there, some people are going to the Minecraft Friday night party. Um, uh, mine, mine, mm, my voice is, my mouth is getting dried out. Mind crack, the mind, mind, uh, crack server, <laughs> I could get the D out, is, uh, having a bowling party Friday night. And I, but you had to pay, like, I think it was like $40 to get into it, uh, something like that. And I kind of decided, I, I talked to Poet, Poet said he wasn't going to go. I was like, you know what, if you're not going to go, I'm not going to go either. And uh, turns out there's actually a lot of people going that I could have hung out with other than Poet and Winter. But anyway, we decided not to go. I decided to go with him. Uh, with him, I decided not to go. And um, no animals yet. Come on, animals, start spawning. Do they spawn this high? Yeah, they got to. Right? Do they spawn this high? I feel like they should. Cause like mountain, there's mountain biomes, right? They have like high hills and they spawn up there, right? Guess we'll find out, won't we? I feel like we had one spawn up here one time. No, it's not possible. This is the only time we've had grass up here. Hmm, that's gonna be something interesting to find out. Uh, but anyway, after that, I'll wait for them and then we'll probably go. Me and Poet and Win, we'll probably just go to uh, the, our hotel we're staying. It's actually, actually, it's it's really awesome, and uh, it's got like clubs and bars and stuff like that in there and I, I mean I, and we'll probably just go hang out at those and see if we can meet any other uh youtubers there but uh yes i don't uh i don't think we'll be getting crazy or anything uh because well i can't say why because i'm not sure if i'm allowed to say why <laughs> but i know i won't be drinking or anything i do know that um but uh yeah that we'll probably still go hang out there with guys and i know that's a lot of people just they go find stuff to do. You know, there's this awesome like pool. I don't know if there's any indoor pool. There's probably actually the pool's probably closed. No, it's it's Florida. Pools don't close in Florida, or do they? I don't know. I don't live in Florida. Never have. Um, but yeah, it's just gonna be it's just gonna be an awesome event, and and we are all excited about it. Where am I going, and what am I planning on doing? Oh jeez, I'm gonna jump down in here. I'm gonna go back to the storage area, drop off some stuff. And I think next episode, what we're going to do is we're going to explore some, I think. I don't know. I'll find out tomorrow because I'm going to start. This is my last recording for tonight. And then um, tomorrow, uh, I'm going to record three more episodes of this plus two episodes of Dinosaurs. So that's my Friday night itinerary is to hang out and have a good time and wait and wait and wait and wait and wait and wait. But Saturday, I'll tell you guys about that tomorrow, but Saturday is going to be packed. A packed full day of Minecon alicious fun. So, anyway, let's head back over here. And we will have a good time just hanging out over this way next to the storage area. 
Plus, we have easy access to getting down from there for next episode, depending on what we're going to do. And uh, hopefully, we'll have some animals spawn over there in our, in our area. If not, then I'm going to have to find some fancy way of getting them up there without them falling off and dying. And it's going to be difficult. So, anyway, guys. That's going to be it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, feel free to hit that like button. And today's question of the day is going to be, if you could have, what would you rather have? Uh, a rock in your eye or an eyelash in your eye? No, no, not an eyelash or a bug in your eye. A rock or a bug. I only thought about that because I saw the eyeball sticking out of the top of the thing. Like if something had to get stuck in your eye, a gnat or a rock? What would you what would you rather have? There's there's positives and negatives for both. First of all, bugs getting in your eyes is just disgusting. It happens, but it's it just it helps. I would say eyelash, but that's kind of like oh that's just normal. Um, I've had the thing with the rocks getting in your eyes. I think it's safer to have a bug in your eye, even though there's probably some bacteria stuff going on there. But rocks will scratch your iris, and then you can't see right for a few days. Until it heals back up. Look how awesome my house looks back there in the sunset. I love that. That's the only time that house looks good. Uh, but I think I'm going to have to say, just for the scratch factor, I'm going to have to say with a gnat, a bug, going in my eye. So, I know that's kind of a weird question, but that's what came into my head. So, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. If you, uh, we've already, why don't I do this part a second time? Uh, thanks for watching. We'll catch you guys <laughs> later.